Hey Taurus. This is going to be a reading for you versus them. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. This is a general reading, you guys, so it's not going to resonate for everyone. So if it doesn't res resonate, please don't try to make it fit. Okay. If you guys like the video, please hit that like button. Also, share and subscribe. Let's see. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. What's going on? For December 9th through the 15th. Taurus. What's going on for Taurus? December 9th through the 16th. Taurus. One more shuffle, guys. Alright. First card out we have is the Ace of Wands. Hmm. I feel like somebody is very has has grown in attraction here um where there was possibly unrequited love before wanting to start over want to start new almost start off new because i feel like in the past um maybe maybe the attraction for somebody wasn't fully realized in there is what i feel yeah fire energy here very attracted to somebody um, wanting to start over after walking away you walked away from this person or they walked away from you energy can go vice versa they walked away from you because they didn't feel um, fulfilled at some point or you didn't feel fulfilled at some point um, the eight of cups is always you know when something is not serving you any longer this is when this cup, this card shows up. Um, it's not there anymore. What, what you're needing out of a relationship is no longer there. It's no longer, you know, fulfilling your spirit. So I feel like you walked away from somebody that you did not um, have that level of attraction for or that, that drive for previously. And you're walking right back to the Two of Cups here, like I stated before. You're seeing this person in a different light. And they you. I feel like this person has always loved you, though. I'm just getting that strongly. There's always a love there for you. We have the Eight to the Two of Cups. This is walking away to come back. Okay? To have that full happiness with that person that, um, that you are no longer with. This is coming back to a situation now realizing that you do love this person. This person is the one that you want to spend your life with possibly. Your feelings are clear. Everything is clear to you now. Where you probably were confused before, you're no longer confused here with the moon card. Strong Pisces energy here. Aries as well. I feel. Okay. Let's see what's going on with this other person. This other person is, is has feels like they've been through the battle. They feel like they've been through the battle, and they're very. Um, I'm not gonna say they're very defensive, but they are treading lightly where love is concerned at this point because I, I feel like it was a burden for them. Um, once you walked away, Ace of the Nine of Wands, Ten of Wands, um, they're just really kind of getting out of that energy where. Um, that they've been really, really hurt. Um, they've been really disappointed. They're really getting out of that energy, but still defensive because they're, they're not really wanting to allow anything to affect them the way that it has in the past when you walked away. So they, you know, the situation ended, the relationship ended with this person. But I get the feeling that not only you, but they also want to transform rebirth this situation this relationship this connection between the two of you because it is very strong here with the two of cups being present okay scorpio sagittarius energy here okay somebody's manifesting somebody's manifesting they're trying to bring um this love back and i think this is an energy that you both share 
This is an energy that, that you both share. This is somebody that knows how to everything um, that they have in their tool belt, they're pulling it out. Their emotions are stable. Um, their finances are, are stable or trying to get them together. Um, they're willing to take action when action is needed. Okay. They just, you know, they, they know how to speak. They know how to talk. They know how to address issues that need to be addressed without, you know, going overboard here. Somebody's really manifesting, waiting on their ships to come in here, waiting on this connection to come back together. I, I feel like this is this person putting out basically their pheromones, okay? And um, there is definitely a strong bond, a strong love between the two of you. For sure, for sure. This person is reinventing inventing themselves here with the death card. And I need to raise that camera up a little bit. But here with the death card and um, the magician, they're re reinventing themselves. I don't know what kind of person they were before. Maybe they were clingy. Um, maybe they were overly emotional. But um, they're getting themselves together at this point here. Okay. Oh, yeah, we have um, fire sign here strongly. King of Wands there. Yeah, this person is really getting themselves together. So when you decide to come back, because I feel like it's going to be a situation where, you know, you are going, going to need to come back um, and kind of rectify things if it was actually you that left. Whoever left is, is going to have to be the one that comes back to rectify the situation. And I see whoever left is doing, is wanting to do exactly that to start something again. Okay, so that is what I have for you versus them, Taurus, and um, I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now.